First, tension was high at the Beaufort County Schools Board of Education meeting. Some members of the community voiced their concerns of how educators balance controversial topics in the classroom. News 12's Bliana Garland sat in the meeting and has this update. The Beaufort County School Board meeting wrapped up in about an hour with well over 100 people in attendance. The main focus of the public comment section was concerns over what kids are learning in schools. We got gay and lesbian books in the schools. Do you care? LGBTQ content in schools, something retired teacher Terry Ann McClawhorn didn't encounter in over three decades of teaching. Yes, 30 years ago, that was never talked about. A topic former Bellhaven Mayor Adam O'Neill says he doesn't shy away from. He put out this letter describing what he wants the Beaufort County School Board to do with gender and LGBTQ ideas in schools. We don't need to be teaching things that divide people and go against people's religions. We need to be trying to pull people together and teach what's right. He mentioned Going Viral by Katie Cicitelli Cook, a book he says is for rent at Bath Elementary, where the main character is in a lesbian relationship. But I was not given an answer from Beaufort County school leaders if the book is still in the library. You know, a lot of us are concerned that we're putting ideas under the name of tolerance. We're putting ideas that are kind of self-destructive, and we're kind of eroding the foundation of values. The Beaufort County School Board put out a resolution on January 16th defending their educators from the letter's criticism. Accusations of indoctrinating students reached the Beaufort County Community College, where the president, Dr. David Loop, pushed back. Censorship is what's dangerous, and that's what we've got to learn in this country. I think that uh, what they're attempting to do is to censor higher education. Lawhorn says she just wants what's best for her students. And going back to things we did in 1960 is not going to work in the world that we live in today. The school board has not addressed any of the public comments and there are no changes to the curriculum yet. But there will be another meeting right here at 845 North Pierce Street at 330 on February 7th between the school board and the board of commissioners. In Beaufort County, Bilyana Garland, News 12.